biggest in the order of about a quarter of 1%. This as the gaming giant sold a million PlayStation 4 units in its first 24 hours of sales. But can Sony's latest offering take on the mobile gaming juggernaut? Sony needs to get out in front early if it has any hope of regaining its lead in the gaming industry. What is the, the big development in the PlayStation 4 that, that my viewers should know? The PlayStation 4 is really meant for the hardcore gamers. I mean, the tech specs are like a gamer's dream. It is a powerful and accessible system, and it has a deep feature set to support the ongoing development and evolution of gaming itself. 18 hours. That's how long some people stood in line to get their hands on the newest game console, the PlayStation 4. We're about to get a look at the new PS4. What the hell are you doing here? You think I'd let you do this on your own? What the hell have you done to them? They gave it up! Just give me your stuff! You lied to me, Connor. Show's over, Lee. The eighth generation began in November of 2013. After a long seventh generation, gamers are eager to take the next step in console entertainment. It's been absolutely fantastic. Uh, we sold a million units in the first 24 hours. I'm here waiting in line for my boyfriend. He's paying for the PS4, so it's okay. People are getting their PS4s. Everyone's really excited. They're walking out with them. Now we gotta go get ours. It's a no-brainer. It's the Sony. And you know what? It's a gaming console first. It doesn't try to be a jack of all trades and a master of none. It's a master of one, and that's gaming. <laughs> Boom! You have no idea how sickening this is to us. It's video game James in the flesh. The launch lineup was jam-packed. Releasing two exclusives and a good selection of third-party entries, the PS4 era began with options spread across many genres. The design is awesome. Some people say it looks like an eraser, but I like the slam. And the glossy part is my favorite. I like shiny things. Hey you in the comments, let me know what your favorite PlayStation design is. Is it the one, two, three, four, or five? I applaud them all. In this PlayStation, I feel definitely displays a next level lifestyle. As the seventh generation came to a close, it was time for newer, fresher hardware. And that's exactly what Sony and lead architect Mark Cerny delivered. The PlayStation 4 was designed for a future of social interactivity and for a smoother experience for game developers themselves. PlayStation laid the game early on, following through with the notion that high-class games hold the highest value on a gaming console. And with a variety of options, Sony had to prove that the PS4 could indeed perform. Do you have any idea how embarrassing it is for me to keep arresting my own brother over and over and over again? Maybe you should stop arresting your brother over and over and you over again. You think this again. is a joke? No. Because I don't seem to Reggie. get it. What? Shrug. We are engaged in a life and death war with these bioterrorists, and it's my job to do whatever it takes to ensure that we win that war. I can't stop it, man. I can't stop it. Reggie, I can't okay. stop it, okay. man. It's okay. You're a conduit? You're screwed, man. Looks like you and me are going to Seattle and we're gonna go get her. Whoa, 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 wait. Woo -hoo! I did this. And I gotta fix it. People are afraid of bioterrorists. They're freaks. See, that's pre-programmed bull. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Bull. You saw it, right? That DUP prison. If she catches you, that's where you're going. Think about it, you'd have to go through, a, what, a thousand DUP guys just to get to her? Yeah, probably something like that. It's one of those freaks! Okay. Whoa! No, 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 no! Oh. <laughs> trying to fix the problems you already have, not add new ones! I hear you've learned a new trick. You've expanded your arsenal. <laughs> Don't hurt me, Nelson! 
remember, we said we were gonna find a cure for you, and this is it. Did you see what I did on that bridge? We I can did. take these Look, guys. Let's just see if we can sneak you through their checkpoints first, all right? I'm warning you, kid. Back off! Oh, no, no! You son of a bitch, I trusted you! I've been watching you, Delson Rowe, testing you while you assembled your little bag of tricks. So tell me, who is the savior? And who's the monster? Infamous Second Son was the third full-length installment in the Infamous series, that of which I'm thoroughly invested in. It was a great showcase introduction to the 2013 PlayStation system. Leading into 2014, with shaky expectations, fans eagerly anticipated more games, as again, many were unsure that this generation would satisfy. It's been a year now. Everybody's got this thing. There are seven million of them in people's homes. Seven million. Which means this year is actually a more exciting year for me, because this is the year that's all about games. All about the games. Two thousand and fourteen offered a needed variety. We saw raw ideas forming to be shaped into something special. The unique presence of two thousand and fourteen was elevated by the re-release of Grand Theft Auto V. I was happily retired, sulking by my swimming pool. Gangster shit, nigga. What? 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 Sorry. Now where sorry. were we on, exactly? Huh? That's a good target. Whoa! That's it. This year saturated the PS4 library and laid a foundation for the palette of creativity that preceded it. And the system was still in its very early stages. As time progressed forward, power continued to be unleashed. 2015 grabbed the torch and ran the race full steam ahead. Development studios pushed for innovation and offered an exceptional selection of gaming. This is how it happened. This is how the Batman died. While exhibiting many fan favorites, the identity of the 8th generation and the PlayStation 4 was yet to be fully determined. 2015 was warranted and fought against a dry spell that seemed never ending. I will have my revenge! Shifting toward the new year, Sony held by their claim that PlayStation was the best place to play. No! No! Run! After incredible showings from first and third party studios, the world of PlayStation would only continue to impressively expand. I see great things in our future, kid. Great things. Hey, Nate. Hi, honey. Oh, hi, I've been trying to get a hold of you. You okay? Yeah, of course, what do you mean? Ooh, you gotta learn to watch your back. <laughs> Nathan, we were meant for this. It took a long time for him to get out of this game. Nate, your brother is dead. <laughs> Either come with me or join him. This is retirement money. I have to pass. And trust me, so should you. Yeah, can I help you? Yeah, I'm uh, looking for my little brother. I will find the greatest pirate treasure of all time. I need you on this one. Just don't think about it. You got this. You and your brother have proven yourselves the more capable treasure hunters on the planet. Rafe is here? That psycho would like nothing better than for you to show up. Plus, he's got Nadine and a whole army to back him up. I wish felt that we were destined for something great. How is Elena cool with all this? Do you have any idea what I put on the line to get you here?
2016 was very solid. The PlayStation 4 was firmly outselling other gaming consoles, and all the more enticing was this class of games. With new additions to popular franchises, gamers were nourished with a batch of promising titles. To be honest, I fell off some here, so I missed quite a bit, but I caught up. PlayStation as a brand focused on the newly released PSVR, delivering more experiences for the players. There was also a bit of nostalgia with the strength of remasters. High quality revisions for beloved games of past generations. While halfway into the life cycle, the peak of the mountain was still ways away. Oh dear. 2017 sparked somewhat of a revolution. This Fortnite thing is taking on a life of its own. The battle royale genre was like a nuclear explosion. I personally had never seen such a phenomenon. So, while that was happening, it appeared to have forced gaming as a whole in another direction. For instance, Destiny 2 got a gazillion updates and patches, and I still don't have the platinum for that yet, unfortunately, because they've changed some stuff. But no big deal, no big deal. The focus now was on expanding game worlds as opposed to having them be completed upon arrival. While I do feel indifferent in regards to that change, I will forever appreciate the games that offer everything from the beginning. But I also understand how doing the opposite can lead to greater player retention as players receive continual content drops and add-on accessories. Now about PlayStation, the family most definitely did their thing with the exclusives of this year. It was led by the ladies. They had to take over one time, many times, very stunning games. I need your help. Having developed a clearer picture, 8th generation games began to emphasize what they would ultimately be driven by. Cast, you came from nothing. At this point, PlayStation continued building their brand with new faces, and there was more to come. But bleeding into the next year, PlayStation once more shipped an Unreal production with a familiar face. <laughs> Close your heart to it. Find your way home. You are free. Wait for my mark. Relax. Your anger. You can get lost in it. Think I'm afraid of you! This will not stand. What are you doing? Who's activated the bridge? Atreus! Again! Stop it! Again! Until our journey is over, one of us must be us! He doesn't know, does he? About your true nature? Or his own? That is none of your concern! You cannot change. You will always be... a monster. Diving into 2018, PlayStation had an established lineup of leading roles for their eighth generation. That group was complemented by this year's unpredictable catalog of third-party games. Still feeling the effects of the previous year, 2018 was valued for the strength of its core titles. The PlayStation 4 had achieved prominence and became a prime time source of recreation. You have my back. Where's our money? By the end of 2018, PlayStation had sold over 90 million PS4 consoles, you got this? with the system being so profitable. This. 
the PlayStation family's ability to offer excellence re-earn their respect. Falling into 2019, I feel this year was the pinnacle of the eighth generation. By this point, graphical fidelity had reached maximum, which means we were seeing the PS4 at its very best. entirely would go into outperform other avenues of media because of the global pandemic, eventually generating more currency than sports and movies combined. PlayStation continued to expand its territory as a global force. 2020 was a period of uncertainty for many reasons. As uneasy as times had been, gaming developers and forerunners pulled together to provide high-class entertainment for the players. PlayStation's 8th generation run is distinguished for its drive. Even while at the very end of the hardware cycle, their exclusive studios continue to exponentially excel and outweigh expectations. I am Samurai. With smash hits from studios like Sucker Punch, Sony Santa Monica, and Guerrilla Games, exclusivity meant value for the PS4. Before we end, I would like to review Naughty Dog's last PS4 exclusive. Sparking differing opinions, this game in a way reflects the entire generation. Are you willing to do what it takes for survival? I don't know what happened. I'm not supposed to take her to the fireflies and walk away. Because of her, they were actually gonna make a cure. Everything that we've been fighting for, all the sacrifices, all of the horrific... <laughs> is justified with this one act. And what if this was Abby? You're doing the right thing. <laughs> the only catch. Sweet Jesus. Doctor! What are you doing? It would kill her. If this was your daughter, what would you do? Jesus Christ, Joel. If it was me, what do you do? I'd want you to do the surgery. I won't let you take her. This is our future. Think of all the lives we'll save. What does Ellie know? I told her. Her immunity meant nothing. There was no cure. No! Don't look. Dad! And she believed you? I didn't say otherwise. He's at a settlement out in Wyoming. You hear yourself? Back up! I don't need your fucking help, Joel. I would do it all over again. I fucking knew I couldn't count on you. I let you both live. And you wasted it! As we come to a close, it would be impossible to thank every individual person who contributed to this generation. But for the countless moments of fun, escape, and intrigue, I express gratitude for the experiences that makes the eighth generation unforgettable. Thank you.
This white dude just came up and started dancing with him. <laughs> Let's go! Let's go! You did it! Yeah! Oh. Yeah!